All right, guys. Welcome back to another video. It's your man Jay Will. It's a gloomy day out. It's well, it's not too gloomy. It was really looked like it was going to storm earlier. Uh, but this is the Moto Z's real cam rear camera. I'm recording at 1080p at 60 frames per second because you know it's my favorite to do. Uh, it is sunset, you know what I'm saying? So it's not real sunny out. Uh, but the camera is really nice. I can appreciate it. Is it the best on the market? Nah, but it's good. I like it. So um, it definitely performs better than my Moto G. I've had some problems with my Moto G um, actually getting a little warm and cutting off as I'm recording and that's extremely frustrating. I talked about that on the Moto G um, panel that we did. Shout out to those guys who was on the Moto G panel. I appreciate the love man. So I'm going to go to the front camera now. Right, guys this is the front camera on the Moto Z. Uh, it's, I always look at the screen. I need to look right here at the camera. Anyway, just a real quick video. Uh, front camera, you can see my gray down here. Oh my gosh. It's outside. It's a nice nice day out. It's getting actually pretty cool out here because it was going to rain earlier. But um, uh, So I appreciate the love, man. I'll, this is the front camera and rear camera video sample from the Moto Z uh, on Verizon. It's exclusive to Verizon right now, unfortunately. Uh, there is an unlocked version, but it's... Um, uh, you know, it costs the same. You know, the Z Force. Uh, everybody keeps asking me uh, why I didn't get the Z Force. I've said it a number of times. I wanted the thinner phone because I bought all, I bought all the mods. And actually, the battery, this 2600 milliamp hour battery, I'll get into that later. But it's nothing like what you what you think it is. Uh, even Floss said in his video that this battery is pretty good. So front camera. See you guys in the next video. Take care.